is the Bat Hound Simon at Best ASA Softball Bats there are. Today I'm here to bring you a durability update on the Rucket Sports Batting Tee. I have 9,995 swings on so far. We're going to take it to 10,000 and then give you some up closes so you can see how durable it is. Been getting quite used to taking out of this bag. It's gotten quite a bit of use and the bag is holding up real nice still. Take the tee out. Fold the legs down, twist and pull out the middle, put it on the other side, twist, and you're ready to go. Let's get some more swings on it. All right, this is 9,996. Now the other thing I've noticed, I've never hit this T over yet. I mean, you can really, really smack it and it's not gonna do anything, so. You don't have to worry about hitting the tee and having it fall over. 9,997. 9,998. Two more for the 10,000 mark. Now, I typically, I, I've been making my own tees, but this thing's unbelievable. 9,999. Let's take it to 10,000 and get some close-ups. 10,000! All right, let's get some close-ups of the tee. All right, well, I wanted to take at least one video of it about halfway through, uh, just in case it broke between here and to the 10,000 mark, which is what I wanted to get to. And as you can see, I mean, this thing looks new. I mean, I cleaned it up a little bit with, you know, some warm water, but uh, this looks fantastic still. Now, keep in mind that most of these swings took place in a cold garage up in Wisconsin through the winter. And here we are again. It's over the 7,000 mark, still looking great. This time, I intentionally didn't wipe it up, so I left all the dirt on it. Now, I also used weighted training balls uh, on the tee throughout the winter, and the, the telescoping never lost any strength throughout the whole time, which I was very impressed with. I was also impressed that the tee never fell over a single time through all the swings. I've also enjoyed how simple it is to set it up, and the height range on the tee is wonderful. And of course, with this many swings on the tee and it being carried around in the bag, the bag gets some good wear and tear, but that has held up well too. All right, let's see what it's like after 10,000 swings. Look at that. Now I washed this up with some warm water and a rag for its final showcase, but that looks brand new still. So this is what I have to say about this tee. I was skeptical on how long this could last, and when I thought about getting it to the 10,000 mark, I didn't think you could make it. But wow, was I wrong. This tee clearly passes the durability test in my book. Well, there you have it. Durability update on the Rucket Sports batting tee. Not really a microphone, just being silly. Uh, the link is down below if you're interested. Feel free to leave any comments, questions down below. This is the Bat Hound, everyone, sounding off. Be sure to subscribe to the channel here. Check out some other videos here and here. Thanks, everybody.